Say hello. Hello. <laughs> I am almost prepared. <laughs> Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Teresa Artigas. Welcome to the 4 o'clock live painting. Um, this is what I'm going to be painting today. A friend, Dale Peters, his name is down here, um, does beautiful portrait pictures of uh, photographs of wildlife and if you see his uh, Facebook page he's got some amazing amazing uh, wildlife photos so I saw this on his page and I was like oh my gosh it's so beautiful that would be awesome to paint and he said go ahead <laughs> so here I am um, what I did was I just printed it out on uh, computer paper and I'm using a 20 inch um, canvas I'm gonna be doing acrylics and um, if this is your first time here, my name is Teresa Artigas. I'm a local portrait artist and painter. Um, my husband and I own a photography studio on the Jersey Shore. And during the time home, I've decided to do a four o'clock live demonstration painting every day to take people away from the world for a little while and enjoy watching me paint. If you're interested to have me create a piece of artwork for you, there'll be a little link in the top section that you can click on and find about the find out about the special that um, I'm having. So if you have a cell phone picture or something that means something to you, click on the link. You can find more out more about it. So I'm just going to jump right into this and um, start doing my process. So what I'm going to do is kind of sketch it out a little bit with some pencil, and then I'm going to pick my colors, and we'll go from there. So I hope you enjoy watching. I don't think I'll get done with this today. Sometimes. I know you won't get done with this. Um, no, sometimes I do these and it takes me a couple days. <clears throat> but right now I'm just folding this over to um, get a uh, sense of what I want to, how I want it cropped. I thought this was way too square, even though it's beautiful, but my piece is very horizontal, so I thought that would be kind of cool so I could save the reflection. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to tape it somewhere mm. maybe here mm. <laughs> I don't know I wish I could tape it like there but I don't have that piece up there to do where's my tape right here so Dale if you're watching say hello <laughs> um, actually these are spoon bills right Mike what did you, did you say they were he said they're spoon bills I thought they were flamingos well it first. says that they have that spoon at the end of their the shape if you look at it mm. the shape yeah and if he goes on while the live is happening, he could actually comment on a little bit about where he took the photo and um, a little bit about them. And then people could kind of read. Let me just tape this on here. <laughs> Maybe we should name them. Huey, Dewey, Louie. <laughs> I don't know. There's not enough of them. There's too many, okay, too so many spoon bills. My bracelet. I thought they were flamingos at first. Well, no. He, yeah, if you look at them, just I a know. little taller. Okay, so what I'm going to do is a little bit of a, a, a rough sketch. Where's my pencil? It's lying around here somewhere. That is it. It's not the one I wanted. This is Chloe's <laughs> leftover. It was a different pencil. All right. There it is. I want this pencil. You don't want the one with all the cartoon characters on? No. What are those? Mm -hmm. Those are uh, Shopkins when she was in her Shopkin phase. Oh, yes. And we spent $4 billion on Shopkins. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, turn the button. I there we go. I just put my phone on so I can see if Dale jump, jump if Dale jumps on. Okay, so gonna do a little rough sketch. So 
Oh, we've got a little greenery. Okay, so. Got quiet all of a sudden, didn't it? <laughs> yes, it did. Okay. Let's just bring over his neck here. Oh my gosh. Work on that area a little bit. There's one. <laughs> okay. edges on here. Get the lip like that, right? It's got a little inner in here. Kind of. Needs to be more, <laughs> a little more straight. <laughs> okay. It's like a droopy bill. <laughs> mm. <coughs> Alright, hold on. This line needs to be a little straighter. Mm. <sighs> so, in a new escapade for our puppy today, he decided he didn't like one of the bushes outside. <laughs> it's a massive bush. And uh, he leaped in it and tried to kill it. <laughs> <laughs> the bush won the fight. Okay. Two. Where's his other leg? I don't know where his other leg it is. It must be up. Goes him like he looks like I don't I don't I don't see it. You see it somewhere in here there's gotta be a leg. Well if they're like flamingos. See so the other one there to the left, that one doesn't have his he has a leg up. That's his leg? Well I think it, they tuck this, it up. That's weird. That looks like Well flamingos do that, where they balance on one leg. Yeah. And they, they, they're they so similar looking, they have to be related somehow. Oh, I think the leg's <clears> coming <throat> from back here. I can see somewhat. Uh, well, you can always add a leg. But. Yeah, I can. So that, maybe that's the bottom of his foot. We'll have to ask Dale. Is that the bottom of his foot? <laughs> you took this picture. I see Dale's on. Mm. See, the, where's his leg? Is his leg, like, right here coming out and then... Like, what kind of foot does he have? Is it like a webbed foot, or what's that all about, Dale? I don't know. I'm going to try to draw it right, but it's hard to well, see. How, how's he going to know? He took the foot. I don't know. He's watching. Maybe mm. he can comment. <laughs> it's hard to see in the little shadow there. Okay. Then we've got the next one.
Once I get this drawn, it'll be easier to get the colors in and the paint going, but I kind of have to do this first, which is kind of my process, so it's kind of cool that you can, you can see that part of the process. See how that goes here. And he's supposed to be up further. So he's back further. You're leaning on me. Um let's erase him. Just wanna get a little bit him a little bit back further. Oops, that's the shit. That's not his leg all the way down. That's the reflection. Okay. <laughs> I'm thinking his leg is that tall, and I'm like, that's what's throwing me off. So. Mm. There we go. So he's got his leg in water right here. It's a rough. It's very rough. <laughs> okay, let's go on to the next one. Not gonna have much. Oh, I'll have a little bit for the shadow, yeah. Okay, so we've got this guy here. And we've got this guy over here. He's about I think his bill is shorter. This one? Mm hmm. Which is what's throwing you off. Better? Oh, that's too pointy. That's better. Because his bill goes past his chest. Yeah, yeah. you're right. You're right. That's what I, I could tell that was throwing you off a little. Yeah. Okay, so let's go with uh, this guy over here. Okay, <laughs> let's move on to the next one and I can tweak them later. 
Okay, so then we got this guy. He's, he's like part of the, the group, but all these guys are looking at him taking the photo, and he's like, I'll have no part of this. <laughs> I do not want to be part of this. <laughs> so, let's see. Got this guy over here. What was that? Somebody dropped their phone, I guess. Upstairs. So this goes down here. should use that thing that you bought me to like what's that thing called that you bought me that i haven't tried out yet well, it's a little too late now it is but i'm just saying <clears> like <throat> i think we should try that <laughs> it kind of helps you like, it like helps project something and then you can kind of fill in the lines or i don't know what it is but we'll figure it out Challenging right here. What am I not getting? Hey. Ben. Ben. You're not saying nothing, Mike. <laughs> you are fine, Tate. <clears throat> This bend <sighs> needs to be shorter oh. and more of an angle because it ends right there in the water. I know, but it's under the bill. I understand that. But there you go. I'd like to get painting on it. <laughs> but this little leg in this bill is giving me a little trouble here. Hold on. Give me a minute. <laughs> Make the bill wider. At the base. Oh, let's see how far down we go. More spoonish. There you go. Okay, let's try this again. Uh, just, leg. it's just peeking up behind your leg. I'm gonna take a really sharp turn. There you go. Yeah, it stops right about there. Yeah. And this one comes over a little That bit. one needs to come over. Unless he's bow-legged. <laughs> and he just might be. He might be in my culture. Although, <laughs> <laughs> we're going to represent him as a bow-legged spin, spoon, spoon bill. <clears throat> there we go. There you go. All right, this is dark. All right.
Okay, then we've got greenery, but I don't have to really paint that in. I can do that later. So we do have the reflections down here. Uh -huh. But I don't know if I want to really draw them in. I think I'm just going to start. <laughs> there we go. There's the beginning. <laughs> he needs an eyeball. Okay, let's pick the colors. Uh, this is a really, really pretty blue. And it's deep. I wouldn't say it's royal. What would you say it is, Mike? Blue. <laughs> Thanks. I don't know. <laughs> All right, All right let's, let's go looking for, there's a blue right there. And it's too light. Oh yeah, oops. So I'm just going to grab some blues and kind of pull them out and play with them. Dropping my stuff here. Dropping pull these out. All right. how, many, how many blues? Well, this one I like mixed with another one. So what's this one? Cerulean blue. Mm -hmm. Ultramarine blue. Mm -hmm. That's another ultramarine I don't need. That's another ultramarine. And it's all blue. That's kind of got purple to it, so we'll get that one out. Okay, so let's see what kind of blue I'm going to come up with here. <coughs> Where's my Rob Ross? Mm -hmm. Bob Ross brush. Oh, Bob Ross. Where did it go? It's a big fat one. It's white too. Mm -hmm. Put it over here on the table. Sorry, it's a little messy. You lost your Bob Ross brush? Here. I don't know. Alright, well. Maybe you washed it and it's upstairs. It could be. Okay. Anywho. Alright, let's try these. A little, uh, we'll do a little cerulean blue. No. I gotta undo the top here. Oh, a brand new jug. <laughs> Dale said, probably the photograph photographer's fault. <laughs> There's no fault in the photographer, <laughs> Dale. <laughs> it's just I couldn't see with a little bit of shadow there because it's underneath him. Um, that looks pretty cool, though. This looks so fun to uh, paint. I'm excited. Yeah, if I can get the top of my paint open. Come on. There we go. All right. Blue. Cerulean. Let's do a little ultramarine. And we're gonna do this blue here and see. What blue is that? Lake blue, I guess they're calling it. I don't know, we'll see how they look when I mix it. Okay, so. Try this one and this one. Pretty close, huh? Mm, it's a little lighter. You want it to be darker? Lighter. Oh, you want it to be lighter. Just a hair. There you go. Now, are you going to paint over these <laughs> fine spoonbills? No, I'm going to paint around them. I'm just getting the bottom. A little more. Let me turn my light a little. I am Just in your light. Mm. Let's do the tops. I hope I get to the little spoon bills today, but we'll I see. I don't think the... so. I don't think so. It took a lot of time. No. <clears throat> Just drawing them out took me a little time. It's all right. It's part of the process. Yeah, it is. It's part of the process. Want to get the color down here of the background. I'm gonna actually mix them the three colors. Whoa. Sorry. Jesus. <laughs> It's not. 
Maybe I washed it and you're right, it's upstairs. <laughs> ultramarine to this. Oops. Sometimes it was a little So, you're hardcore today, leaping up all over the place. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell you're excited about this one. Yeah, I just wanted that fluffy soft brush. The fluffy soft brush. That I don't have at the moment. Mm. Trying to get the background color in here. Let me get the sides. The sides are what I tend to forget sometimes, and then I have to come back and redo them. <laughs> Only because it's a wraparound canvas, this one. A lot of times I'll paint on a flat board, um, but this is a wraparound canvas. I like the flat boards. Oops! my head, sorry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How come painters don't wear schmocks? How come you don't wear a schmock? I don't know. You gotta wear a schmock. I have one. My friend Elaine gave me a schmock. You don't and, use uh, it. I don't know. It's kind of hindering. Hindering? Dare you. Yeah. An old t-shirt would be better. Maybe one of yours. <laughs> sure, why not? <laughs> you wear my t-shirts. Chloe wears my t-shirts. <laughs> no. I'm the only one who doesn't wear my t-shirts. <laughs> not anymore. No. So I'm mixing three colors here. Um, I'm mixing the cerulean blue, this one's lake blue, and ultramarine to give me the, the color that I want. Kind of mixed it by eye to see what. What I liked. I'm gonna have to put in here. Probably not with my fat brush. <laughs> Get a bit of water on here. Try to get all this in so I can get to the little birdies today. But we'll see. All right, you're you about to hit. Me? You're about to hit the uh... thirty minute mark. Yeah. <laughs> I know because it was all about me drawing. That's all right, though. It doesn't have to be all. It's just part of the process. Just because you don't end up painting the birds today doesn't mean. Yeah. You <clears> just <throat> have to come back tomorrow. That's right. There we go. <laughs> and see the continuation of it. So today is your mommy's birthday. She's out to dinner right now, actually. Yeah. 
Yeah, last week was your dad's birthday. He turned 80. And it was Father's Day. And then it was Father's Day. And it was also the wedding anniversary. <clears throat> yeah, they've been married a long time. Mm -hmm. Over 50 years. Well, let's not forget the top up here. You want to say he's 50... Three? 53 or 54 years. Oh, wow. <clears throat> Let's do the sides. Where are Michael's watch today? smaller brush now. Yeah, I'm going to get to it. I'll just get into this area here a little bit. Then I'll start defining around the, the little birdies. Get a little more blue here. We ran into, what was the gentleman's name that we ran into when we were in Florida? that we went to his studio and he did all those beautiful um, Florida um, scenics um, off the top of my head. We met him and we went into his studio and it was really wonderful. What was his name? Um, I have to, I'm going to have to tell uh, Dale about him because he was pretty awesome. To... Oh, in New Smyrna Beach? Yeah, he was in New Smyrna. Uh, he just moved his studio. To just literally move it. I have to pull it up. Maybe I'll put a link on the bottom of this when we're done. Yeah. Well, we gotta put Dale's link. Light, something light? I gotta look it up. No. Okay. Let's okay. Just see. Well, you're, I'm, just, you're, I'm blending a little bit. I know I'm getting to the 30 minute mark. Well, you're past it. That's okay. You eclipsed it. I eclipsed the 30 minute oh, mark. Yeah. It's alright. I'm just trying to. Who thought blue would have taken so long? <laughs> Alright, let's rinse this a little bit here and get a different brush. leave the outline of these little guys so that I don't have to guess and like redo it. <laughs> I'll define it as I go. Just want to get a basic So I was wondering where in Florida, Dale, was this actually taken? What part? Was it like in a special wildlife like refuge or did you just go to a certain spot, lake or or the ocean where near you? Just curious.
darker blue on there. Whoops. They look weird like that, don't they? <laughs> All white cut out yeah, kind of. It's like a... <laughs> It's very weird looking. <laughs> it's an R or something. Uh... <laughs> it's very weird. I don't normally, I don't think I normally paint like this. Well, like, no, you don't. It's kind of weird. <laughs> It's kind of a rough to get me going, you know. It's got to be very rough. Yeah, we got all that green under there too, so got that, got that, get in there, get in there, there. You missed a spot. Where? The big guy on the right, underneath Here? his chin. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, I didn't get over here either. You need a smaller brush for that, maybe. Yeah, probably. Let me make sure I get all my dark spots that I want here. Smaller brush. And then what I'll do is probably, um, because this is still... It's very wet. Wet. I can't really get in and do the greenery. <coughs> Excuse me. I think we'll have to do the the little birdies tomorrow. But mm -hmm. um, let me get in here with a smaller brush. Let me find the brush I want here. There it is. Just to get in there a little tighter. A little blue. here a little bit. I can't even put my finger there like I want to. Okay, got him. Let's tweak him a little bit more. Leaves around his head. I'll fix his head once I get a little more. Okay, let's see what we got here. This guy, there he is. That. I hear the dog whining. I hope that uh, they're watching him up there. Let's get a little darker here. And a little bit over here. Okay, so that's kind of a rough. Okay. I want wrong color on that. It'll be a little darker. I'm going to 
to find my other brush though before tomorrow so I can kind of play with it. All right. <laughs> it looks a little weird with the white birds at the moment. <laughs> but tomorrow they'll look pink and white. Um, so that is where I'm going to leave off today. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to do all the rest tomorrow. This is going to dry. It won't take long for it really to dry, but I always usually do a half an hour to 40 minutes and we're kind of past that, you know, time point. And um, I'll let this dry overnight and then we'll be back tomorrow at four o'clock unless some weird thing changes and we change it to six, but it's usually four o'clock um, depending on what we have now that the studio is open. So if you would like to have me paint a piece of art for you and you have a picture or photograph, phone picture, whatever, click on the link above and you can find out more about it, uh, the special I have. I hope you enjoyed watching me today start the creation of these beautiful spoonbills. And um, we'll be back tomorrow. I hope you guys all have a great 